What's up, buds? How's it hanging? I'm Greg. I'm out. And today we're back to play some more Gears of War 3. When we last left off, we had just arrived at Azura, but there are locusts here, and that's a problem. Locusts are a problem we can solve, though. But before we do, if you like our faces, leave us a like, and if you want to subscribe, then you should subscribe, man. You should do it. You should totally do it. Please and thank you. So without further ado, let's start to finish the end of this war. Dang. I don't know what I just said there. I don't remember this part too much. Uh, Do they not see us? I don't know. Are we supposed to be sneaking? Oh well. Screw stealth. I was about to say, I just popped dude's head off, so I hope not. Chainsaw battle! Ch -ch -ch chainsaw Chainsaw! Uh, I unironically listened to that the other day. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. I always, like, anytime I listen to shit like that, it's always unironically. Like, I, I love shit like that. Like, uh, I like that song, but sometimes I'm just listening to it because it's silly. Yeah. Like my boss got me listening to uh, this guy. His name is A2M. I think I've heard of him, yeah. Yeah. I know what it stands for, and it's not right. No. It's not right. It's funny as hell. He got he got the song called I Got Bitches. It's just funny. Let's just say his name stands for something that's incredibly nasty. I asked him out. <laughs> that's how you get a yeast infection in your mouth. <laughs> I don't even know if that's true. That would just be fucking hilarious. You know, apparently a yeast infection will smell like bread. Really? Yeah. I did not know well, that. Well, I heard a girl say that. I don't know if it's true. It's probably not true. It's probably just her saying something weird, but... Probably. I thought it was funny. You got bread puss. <laughs> <laughs> got bread puss. Good old bread puss. Did you happen to catch the uh, Nintendo Direct? Not the Direct itself, but I've seen what all is coming out. No, I'm highly excited for it. Super Mario RPG Remake! Yes, that and the Metal Gear Solid Collection. Yes, I'm super excited for that. I, was, it, I just think it's funny, because like, literally last week, I was like, man, I've never played Metal Gear Solid 1. I would like to be able to. We can play it for the channel. Yes. That'd be amazing. I wish they would have released the, um, the GameCube version, though. Yeah, I've seen the second one and the third one is like uh, like the updated version one, but the first one isn't. Oh, is it the one that they put on the 3DS then? That I have no idea. I just noticed like in the, th uh, whenever you can buy it in the online store, it actually has like a little message down there saying like updated version, updated version underneath like the second and third one, but not underneath the first one. Huh. Yeah. They're also remaking Metal Gear Solid 3 like completely, which is really? amazing. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't see that. That's, that's a lot of people's favorite one. That's the, that's the only one I've beaten. Oh, you've actually played that one? Yes, I actually beat it. It's whenever uh, I was living at the hotel. Oh, that's cool. I love those games. I haven't played Metal Gear Solid 4 yet though, which I've heard is amazing. Didn't that only come out on PS3? Yeah. yeah. I've never owned a PS3. I found one, and I sold it like two weeks later because I didn't play it. I completely forgot that you had one. Yeah. I literally only had it for a few weeks. I didn't have anything against it. I just already had an Xbox 360. I just... I don't know why I didn't play it. Because I don't even think I had a... No, I had a 360 then. That's right. Yeah. I think I only played God of War on it. I had so many 360s because they kept crapping out, dude. And I'm not even joking. It was probably like 16 of them. I know you had a lot. I only sold one because I needed money. I needed rent money and I didn't have it, so I had to sell my Xbox and I was sad. <laughs> yes. Oh, and there was one that I, that didn't crap out on me, but I just lost it because we had some crazy stuff happen with my family. I lost all my comics that way too. That sucked. That. Yeah, I remember you telling me that. I'm so glad I thought to grab my guitar. I would have been so mad. I probably would have went to jail because I would have freaked out. You probably would have broken that house over that guitar. Yeah, I would have freaked out. I would have attacked somebody over it. Yeah, that's that is literally the last thing your uncle gave you. Like, yeah. <laughs> it's one of the most important things I own. That is why you still play guitar to this day. I imagine it's because your uncle gave it to you. Yeah, he somehow saw that I would enjoy it. I guess he saw me playing guitar here, and he's like, he's probably he'd probably like regular guitar. You are pretty beastly guitar here. Yeah. I almost bought a Guitar Hero uh, controller the other day. You should have. It's a hundred bucks though. For what? Yeah, it's a hundred bucks. Cause Cause it's like a, clone a special hero. one, but oh, I was about to say probably because <clears throat> a Clone Hero is getting big. 
I'd love to make some episodes of Guitar Hero. I just don't know how it would work with copyright. I think I'd be okay with it as long as they didn't block it. But music is sometimes weird about that. Yeah. That's the main reason why I don't like react to new music and stuff. I want to. Yeah. It's just I don't think I'd be able to get around copyright. You want it? Nah, you can take it. Okay. Yeah, I know. That's why, like, mainly I uh, watch uh, people play it on TikTok. Like, on their live... It has to be, like, a live stream, I think. Why is it not such a big deal with live? I don't understand that. I don't know. It should just not be a big deal, period. I think it was just standing there. <laughs> yeah, like, if it's... It, what? What's the difference if it's live? Who knows? I would see, like... It has a good thing. Yeah, promoting music. Yeah. Yeah. They're getting free promotion, literally. Literally. Oh, God. I said literally. <laughs> Little League. Little League. Damn, that reaver went down quick. Did uh, you get it? Yeah. He just melted. I kind of remember this part now. I think there's a big old twister somewhere. Oh, wait. We're inside the giant twister. Duh. <laughs> Do you need ammo? Oh no, you got the robot. I got the robot. It would be scary to be here, dude. It would be. Even though there's no lightning and thunder, I'd be afraid I would be getting struck down. I want to It looks like lightning should be here, so I'm scared. I hear boomers. You know, that's one thing I never thought about. What's that? Do the uh, like the maulers and stuff? Do they say boom? Because they're the same species. I don't know. It'd be funny if they were just like, Mauler. <laughs> Mauler. Grinder. They just announce what they are. Grinder does. He does. They grind. Oh, yeah, that's right. Can I execute somebody in Silverback? Oh, the frame rate right here. What's happening? I don't know. Oh, I'm down. I got to take down this reaver first. Hopefully somebody else will get you. Oh, you almost got exploded. Okay, I got you. <laughs> Thank you. That would have been funny if he would have actually hit you. That would not have been. I mean, I would have been mad at myself, but it would have been funny at the same time. I didn't even realize these guys were over here. They were just chilling. He did not have his chains already there. Oh, they never do. I swear it's even worse on insane. Like it's like ten times worse. He was even in the middle of shooting. Why will it not let me pick up a lancer? Oh, because I already have one. Why did my sniper rifle go then? I don't know. What'd you do with it? You accidentally picked up. I did. The hammer burst. I think I did. I'm just. I almost died. Oh shit! There's a boomer. There it is. I found it. Oh, he almost got me with the chainsaw. Don't rev it up. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Have you ever lost a chainsaw duel? Uh, to a computer, no. Online, yes. <laughs> you jerk off too much, man. Yeah, right. Do you remember playing Mario Party back in the day and getting fucking like rub burn yes. on your hand from spinning the joystick? Yes. I've actually been reliving that a little bit. Can't even lie. Because I've been playing Mario Party on the Switch. Oh, they still make you do it on there? Yeah. I'd be afraid the joystick would start to drift. That's why I don't try not to do it. I keep forgetting that they actually have the uh, Mario Party 1, 2... Do they have 3? No, not yet. Okay. It's like they only got Pokemon Stadium 1, 2. Like, why, why is there only Pokemon Stadium 1 on there? Like, 2 is, like, way better. But I feel like there's no reason to play more or uh, I was about to say Mario Party, uh, Pokemon Stadium anymore. I feel like if I wanted to play a 3D Pokemon game, I'd just throw in the new ones. Yeah. Cause I that, don't know. that was the whole novelty of it for me. It was still pretty cool. It was still pretty cool to like go through all like the old gems and all that kind of shit again. Yeah, but the Pokemon suck on there. <laughs> they do. I'm having to, like, use Pokemon I never would have back in the day. Like, they give Charmeleon Flamethrower, but they don't give Charizard Flamethrower. Yeah, they give him Fire Spin. Yeah, why would you give him Fire Spin? That's, like, one of the worst moves, dude. 
I've never used that before. Nobody uses it. It's fucking fire speed. Nobody wants to do it nothing for three turns while it barely does any damage. I'd rather use Leech Seed. Yes. Leech Seed is actually really good in fucking the metagame, apparently, right yeah, now. Yeah, it's really good uh, for setups and stuff. Yes. Because you can do Leech Seed and you can poison them. Yep, poison, confuse, and fucking Leech Seed. They're sitting pretty. I forgot I had a Torpo. Oh, here's a sniper if you want it. Oh, where are you at? Oh, okay, well, Silverback can't get out. I'm just gonna leave this here because I can move faster without it. <laughs> I'm all the way on the other side of the map, apparently. How'd you get all the way over there? I don't know. I don't even know where the fuck to go. This is a random switch of topic, but I've also been playing uh, Tears of the Kingdom lately. Oh, yeah! And I, I gotta say, it's, it's way better than Breath of the Wild. Like, way better than Breath of the Wild. I don't think that's really hard for us, though. We didn't really care for it. Yeah, I think it's the Ultra Hand mechanic that really does it for me. Mm. I don't know, I've been playing Link to the Past. Link to the Past is good as well. Yes. I haven't played it since forever ago, but yeah. I do love it. Whoa! Whoa! I saw that. Oh, he got ran over, though. Oh, no! I shot you in the back of the head! <laughs> yeah. Oh, I thought you were getting chainsawed. Nah. You were the one that was doing the chainsaw. Yes. Not today, Jesus. You know, come to think of it, I think my biggest problem with uh, Tears of the Kingdom was just feeling like I wasn't making progress. <laughs> and I get that. And it would take forever to go places. Oh yeah, I could see that too. I also don't like having a stamina bar. Like for running. I understand with climbing and swimming and everything like that, but there should be no stamina bar for running. I get that. I know why it's there. I just don't think it should be there. It would be much more enjoyable to get around if I could just infinitely sprint. Yeah. But you can build, like, cars and stuff on there, so... Oh, really? Yeah. You just can't do it, like, right at the beginning efficiently. Mm. At least for me, it took a while to, um... get to a point to where I had, like, a steering wheel. Or a steering stick, I guess. <laughs> Like before, you were just kind of going where the wind took you. Yeah, that That's was your funny. only choice. That's funny as shit. I also didn't realize how to like uh, get more battery for the longest time. Mm. How do you get? You gotta go into the underground and collect this thing, this stuff called zonite. Ow. Yeah, I didn't know about that until, like, way too late. And I was so upset. I was like, having more of that juice would have been, uh, would have been really useful earlier. I don't even think I increased my hearts until, uh, I had, what? like, two things of stamina. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I remember you telling me that. Yep. I need to just chainsaw somebody. I know, I looked down right at it when it was happening. Dad, we're in a loading bay near the rail track. Dad, we're in a loading bay near the rail track. We need to find a way up to the top of the cliff. I've been reading a lot lately, too. I know you have been. I read the new Hunger Games book. How'd you like that? It was pretty good. Was it? Yeah. I know you actually kind of like President Snow, so... Well, I, don't, I wouldn't say that, but I wasn't mad that it followed him like a lot of other people were. Yeah. A lot of people wrote it off just for that. I was like, no, nah, it's still a good story. A lot of people wanted the Haven story. Yeah, that would have been amazing. That would have been. A book about his Hunger Games? I think she's saving it. Oh, yeah. She knows if she writes that story, like, everybody's going to buy it that's interested in Hunger Games. I think I would have actually have to get it. But the thing about the... It's called uh, The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes, I think. And... A lot of people felt like she was trying to make people sympathize with Snow, but I didn't feel that way. Hmm. 
He was an asshole from the very beginning. But it was like from his upbringing. Mostly. Okay. Like he was constantly taught that he was better than everybody and stuff. Mm. That makes sense then. At least a little bit. Yeah. And he also hates like, it explains why he hates the rebels. It's because his parents lost everything and died during the war. Like, they were wealthy and lived in the capital, but then he became, like, super poor. Ah. I will say that the actual Hunger Games in the books, in the book, though, wasn't that great. It was short, and a lot of tributes died before it even started. That's true. Found the ladder! Well, I think they made it, like, a rule that they can't kill each other in, like, the... Hunger Games in the future. But they literally just had somebody kill one of the tributes because they slit one of the peacekeepers' necks or something like that. Yeah. They just shot him down. Damn. We're nearly there. Come on. Take the We're nearly there. Come on. And I think there was two more that died before it, but I don't remember how. Oh, they got blown up. <laughs> Ow. Oh. oh, yeah. They were taking, like, a tour of the arena and, like, they got attacked or something. I don't remember exactly what happened. I just know there was explosions and people died. Damn. And Snow almost died. Was Snow part of uh, Hunger Game? He was a mentor. That was the whole uh, part of the story. He was a mentor, and he had to mentor a girl from District 12. Oh, really? Yeah, her name was Lucy Gray, and she was awesome. Huh. They also explained that apparently you can buy your way into the capital, even if you come from the districts. Because there was, like, one of the best characters in the book, his name is Sejanus. And apparently his dad was super rich and bought their way into the capital, and he hates it. Oh, okay. That's weird. Besides Lucy Gray, which is the District 12 girl, he's probably the best character in the book. Huh. He's always telling Snow, like, nah, that's not right, bro. <laughs> <laughs> what district are he from? Or you said capital. Yeah, he lives in the capital. I don't yeah. remember. Oh, I think he came from District 2. Oh, okay. So he was still, like, better off than most of the other districts, but he yeah. was still in the districts. Yeah, District 2 was still the, uh, like, the ones that would volunteer for shit, right? The, well, they had they had some kind of resource that made them more valuable. Oh. I think is what it was. Oh, yeah. No, I do say, like, uh, I don't really see how people can say that Suzanne Collins was trying to have people sympathize with Snow because he does something just so fucking terrible at like towards the end of the book. Really? Yeah. Like it's so it's so bad that like there's no redemption. Oh wow. Oh no 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 damn it. Damn Anya, that was quick. Thank you. Where's the armor cantus? I killed it. Oh, you killed it? There's some uh, lantern ammo. I stuck it with a grenade and then it blew me up. <laughs> oh, that's how you got down? Yeah. Oh, okay. After I read A Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes, I started reading the It book as well. And oh my god, is that thing fucking thick. <laughs> Dude, I, I remember seeing you carrying it last night. I even told you, like, I thought you were carrying, like, a box of food. It looks like a dictionary. It does. I think it has 1,100 pages. Too many. There is so much more than what was in the movie. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because I actually talk about, like, the, the Shining. Like, a little bit of the Shining gift and stuff in that, too. Oh, I think that's in every Stephen King book at some, at some capacity. Yeah, like every one of those characters share like a like a shining quality or the shining quality or something like where they can be telepathic with each other and stuff. Yeah. There's like a mystic turtle in the book that helps them overcome it. <laughs> Isn't you just don't got to be afraid of them? I think that helps, but they do like some kind of ritual in the book to beat him. I do know that. Oh, okay. I haven't got that far, but I've heard about it. They also use a lot of like monsters that weren't in the movie. Okay. Like they have some of like the uh, old Universal monsters, like the Swamp Guy and stuff like that. Oh, okay. The thing that came from the swamp. Yeah, whatever the hell it's called, I don't remember. <laughs> 
Lagoon. Creature of the Black Lagoon! There was like a giant bird that trapped the Mike character, which is like the black dude, in this like smokestack. That didn't happen in the movies. Uh, the kids spend a lot of time apart in the book too, rather than being together. Huh. Like they'll they'll have like whole chapters dedicated to them. Really? Just, yeah, just by themselves. Hmm. I won't fail you this time. That's cool. I'm, I might have to read that after you get done. It's a pretty good read. I won't lie, it could be kinda of boring at times, but other times it's good. Yeah. I've started reading Demon Slayer. Oh yeah. How's that? It's alright. I've slowed down on it a little bit. Like the whole Dude, being able to create demons just by touching them kind of thing, it's like, that's it's a little stupid. Oh, I don't remember that. Ooh! Can play foosball? Yeah. Oh, it didn't do anything. That's lame. Oh, God! Flamethrower! Anya just stood there until that <laughs> man exploded. Hell yeah! yeah. <laughs> I've also started reading comics again. Oh yeah, I've seen you walking. Well, I'm not reading The Walking Dead. Yeah, I've been buying the volumes. What other uh, comic have you been reading? Uh, I read through like a five-issue miniseries of Batman vs. Robin. Oh really? Yeah, it was pretty good. Batman vs. Robin? Yeah. Oh, okay. They were being controlled or something like that by this demon. Ah. It was like Damien, uh, Jason Todd. It was all the Robins, even the girl that was only in like the Dark Knight series. Huh. My phone went burp. Beep, beep, beep. And so I'm going one all the way back here at the beginning. Of it. Nope, right here. Oh, yeah, I saw, I saw this video online, and I wonder what your opinion of it would be. Oh, God. Uh, this chick cheated on her husband and apparently he just dug up her floor like he took all the floorboards off in her limber room and stuff because he paid for it do you think that's justified yes but extremely petty yeah i will admit that it, that is some extremely petty shit but justified i don't know but it rightfully his yes yeah i don't feel bad for her. Mm -mm. i think cheating on someone's like one of the worst things you could do to them yes. that fucks you up so bad mentally I just, yeah, I just, I'd rather break up with a person than cheat on them. It would hurt a lot less. That's the way I've always felt. I felt like if you need to cheat, then you don't need to be in that relationship. Right. So. Well, apparently they'll be like, well, I love them. They just don't satisfy me sexually. It's like, I just don't see how you can say you love somebody and then just go and fuck somebody else. Yeah. Oh, well, I don't love them. And then you don't love the ch other chick either, then. It's as simple as that. Just a weird mindset. Yeah, it's just something you don't want to face. Especially if I was married to somebody. That's like ten times worse. It is. I just kind of ran past everybody. That's what I'm doing. <clears throat> oh, no, 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 no. I almost died. We're good. We're good. Oh, can I still take damage? Ah, I can take damage while I'm changing it. Oh, I'm about to get down. Oh god, oh god, they're gonna have to get you. I'm. Oh well, you're dead. <laughs> I stuck to Kansas, and he downed me, and then he didn't move. That's how it goes. Yes. <laughs> Can you change all that armor, Kansas? You I don't think so. <laughs> you just run up on him and just bitch smacks you. <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm gonna have to take down these guys. Boom, bitches. Double kill. I guess you got the rest of them? Yep, I got the last one now. Alright, so now we gotta go back down. I think a door opens down here, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. Was planning on it, Dad. Okay, Dad. He's my dad. That's it. Everybody out. Did you know, Bob? My dad owns Nintendo. Whoa! Yeah. Your dad, your dad works for Nintendo. He's my dad. That's my dad. <clears throat> I tried to pull the switch. I seen that. 
We're going to die. We gotta get out of here, guys. Oh my golly. <laughs> oh my golly. It reminds me of Zach Galifianakis when he was like, Oh my word! Oh my word. I wonder if they gave you less time or more enemies on Insane right there. We had 43. So. We had 43 seconds. I think that stays the same. <clears throat> Graphics! I actually don't even look that bad. They're not good, but they're not I bad. would say, like, compared to, like, modern day, it's not very good, but it doesn't look bad for the time, no. Yeah. Did you see that water? Yeah, that water was... That water boop, is terrible. Boop, boop, boop. They really didn't get dripping effects back then, did they? Some big-ass raindrops. Yeah. Look at that beauty. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> I've never noticed that Marcus has a flask on his hip. Huh. I didn't either. Oh yeah! I love almost dying! <laughs> that looks kind of beautiful. Sam is bae. I don't even like dark skin girls like that, and she's cute. Yeah, let's do it. And she does have a hell of a tan for having an Australian accent. Yeah. Oh, Jack! It's Jack! You get to have Jack in your party in uh, Gears of War Tactics, too. Oh, really? Yeah, it's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. He has this thing where, like, as long as uh, you're in range, he can have everybody reload so you don't have to do it during your turn, and it was super useful. Oh, I bet. Dizzy's taking the submarine offshore. Tom didn't make it. Oh, they didn't know. Tom didn't make it. Even Baird's getting emotional. Somebody's gonna cut us. Somebody's gonna fucking pay. You got us this far. Let's finish it. Sam, Jay's get back to the ship. I love these games. Then he didn't tell him where to land the troops. They are pretty good. I mean, it's just testosterone full fuel, but still, that works for me. Yeah. Take care of yourself. You too. Okay? Yeah. Aww. You too, Ben. We're gonna bang later. Yeah. <laughs> I'll see you tonight. Okay. We're heading for the main tower. Okay. One thing I do know about uh, Gears of War 4 and onward, Baird is bald. <laughs> is he really? Yeah, he's bald and he has like a goatee. I did not know that. That's awesome. And it's so funny, like the only way they made Cole look older really was I think they made him like a little less buff and they made him ashy. <laughs> <laughs> it's like that's racist. That's fucked up. So you got oh, Anya. So you got oh, nice. <laughs> they gave you a salt off. Yeah, they did. We're gonna need him. He's got a few new tricks to show yeah. you too. He's got a few new tricks. Well, at least I'll start with a lantern. We'll lay down fire for you. Zero six on task, Roger Phoenix. That, we'll lay down fire six. for you. Roger that. Zero six. Well, at least we got air support for you. Oh, I remember this. I keep forgetting I have a damn boom shot equipped. Uh, almost killed myself. Is this the one where at the end we go back to the cog base and have to defend it? I think oh, it might be. It's either this one or the, it was the second one. I can't remember. Yeah. It was the second one. Was it? I'm, I believe so. Oh, that's right, yeah, I, the last fight here is, like, on a giant-ass building. Yeah, and you, you got a mirror there. Yeah, you gotta go around, like, doing shit to the building. Or something. I hope that boss fight isn't hard. <laughs> I don't remember anything about it. I don't think it is, I think it's more annoying. I know he's just flying around the whole damn place. Yeah. 
I'm just going forward, apparently. Or no, apparently I'm going back. Never mind, don't listen to me. You just went backwards? Yes. Fuck that, I'm out! <laughs> I almost got my face blown off by a shotgun. It's okay, though. Nice. Yeah! I completely missed and then I got blown up. There's a lot of enemies. Jesus Christ. I just ran out to the wrong fucking spot. Shoot my gun like Oh wait, I have a salt off. I wonder if they can make a gun sound like that. He's be going through the damn battlefield. <laughs> That would be pretty funny. It would make people laugh so you can shoot them without <laughs> resistance. Oh, he did. It's more turkeys! Hi, turkey! They got hentai hair. Yo! <laughs> I was into hentai when I was, like, younger, but I don't really like it anymore. I'm going to stay quiet on that one. <laughs> I don't know. It's just something was lost on me the older I got. Eh. I prefer seeing real women if I'm going to watch porn. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. Where's the thing I have to shoot? Am I supposed to be shooting something? Or am I tripping? Yeah, over to your left. It's so slow. Turn faster. Did I get it? I'm not even close. It's okay, I got it this time. I got it this time. Da -da! Bitch! You got it. Da -da! Bitch! I thought I missed that time. Huh. Da -da! Bitch! Nice. Good job, Turkey. I love you. You're the best turkey. You're the best turkey. Let's put the assholes out of business. Yeah. That's a cool line. That is. <laughs> All right, I feel like we should probably stop here. After they stop talking. Yeah, but look what happened. You done? You done? Okay, you're done. That's the end of the episode. <laughs> All right, guys, that's another episode of Gears of War Three in the bag. We are closing in on the end of this game, and it shouldn't be too much longer until we beat it. But until next time, stay happy, stay healthy, and do you. Peace, Peace Nuggets.